Luang is a small town in Johor. It is a central landlocked district that borders most of the other districts in the state. We drove from Muar, which took us about an hour and 30 minutes, but you can also get there by bus or train from Kuala Lumpur or Johor Bahru. If you arrive early in the morning, you can start your day by having breakfast at Kluang Rail Coffee, which is right next to the train station. This is especially convenient if you arrive by train, but even if you don't, this coffee shop is a must visit because it's the first branch of this famous coffee brand and has been there for more than 70 years. It's best to come early as it starts to get busy around 9 a.m. Their coffee is roasted in-house and they still prepare their bread using the traditional method that is over a charcoal fire. Apart from the typical breakfast fare, you can also find other popular Johorian food such as lontong and laksa Johor. Before you leave, grab a pack or two of the Kluang coffee to bring home as a souvenir. Next, we went to UK Farm Agro Resort. It specializes in sheep and goat farming. Over 100 acres in size and with thousands of sheep and goats, is the largest of its kind in Malaysia. Here you can explore the farm on a minibus to learn about goat farming, watch how they milk the goats, and buy goat milk products. But they also have other animals like ostriches, deer, ducks, chickens, and rabbits. Each visitor gets a pack of dry grass, seeds, and a bottle of milk to feed the animals. The resort has chalets and dormitories if you like to spend the night on the farm. For lunch, we went to Tangkak Beef Restaurant to try their famous beef noodle. And for dinner, you have plenty of options. We went to Tan Ching Hing Hawker Food Center to have some satay and noodles. It's possible to make a day trip to Kluang, but I'd recommend staying for at least one night. Our choice of accommodation was Kluang Container Swimming Pool Hotel. It has not only one, but two swimming pools. We even got upgraded to a family room. If you have time, you can also go to Kluang Coffee Powder Factory to get a free tour, go hiking at Gunung Lambat and Gunung Belumut, explore the street art, and check out the other farms in Kluang like the Zenshin Organic Park. For such a small town, Kluang sure has a lot to offer, so don't miss out on it the next time you visit Johor. 
Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, share and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.